What is good everybody? Welcome to an Epic My Damn Toys video. Today we got some freaking news for you guys and it is some pretty exciting slash funny slash freaking weird sweet nasty farticle news in the headlines today for MDT. Today's video guys we're going to be discussing something that is going on with one of my favorite wrestlers and it has to do with one of the memes here on the channel. Very interesting development taking place right here guys. I'm going to go ahead and pull it up on the screen and here it is guys. Benjamin Balor, Finn Balor, my boy, the Demon King, one of my favorite wrestlers. You guys know this. If you watch the channel, if you're familiar with me, you know that Finn Balor is one of my favorite wrestlers. He is now bald, and um, I don't think this is going to be a you know a long thing. I don't think this is going to be a really, uh, like, I don't think he'll return to WWE television bald, but for right now, he is bald, and I think what this is, is he went on like a trip and everything, and uh, I think he was just hanging out and trying to, you know, he travels the world a lot. He gets some cool experiences and things of that nature. He just got married recently to this, uh, to this, uh, she's like a newscast lady. Uh, she does like sports, I think, for a certain news program. I don't know the full story on it, but they're married now. It's the reason he has the tattoo on his elbow. All that good-ish. Anyways, uh, he's bald now, and if you guys know that, then, uh, you know what I'm about to tell you. That means that Egghead Finn Balor, yes, Egghead Finn Balor, the Finn Balor that I made, uh, a month ago. I made this figure a month ago. I showed you guys how to make your own WWE action figures bald, and we just happened to use a Finn Balor figure to make this guy bald, and here he is in the flesh. Finn Balor is now Egghead Finn Balor for real. I know it's not completely bald, you know, so it's not technically Egghead. It's not completely clean like an egg would be. However, this is hilarious. I think this is great. I woke up, I think it was Saturday morning. Was this two days ago, three days ago? Maybe it was Monday. Maybe it was Monday. I don't freaking remember, man. But anyways, I woke up that morning and uh, he, I had like so many like tags under his post where he put out this picture here and um, I had so many messages and so many people saying, sending it to me, and I even have had videos the last couple days, uh, people talking about it, and so I wanted to make a video about it, and I wanted to react to it with you guys, because I figured it would be fun, and let everybody know that didn't know that Egghead Finn Balor is a real thing now. It's a real thing, and um, you guys can see the date there. I think I made this Finn Balor figure, the bald-headed Finn Balor, the Egghead Finn Balor meme that was born on the channel. He's been in many videos ever since he was conceived here on the channel. Um, I made that video on like July 29th. And uh, today is September 4th, and I think he shaved his head bald on September 1st, possibly the end of August, August 31st or 30th, and uh, he posted this picture, and now Egghead Finn Balor is a legitimate thing. It's a legitimate thing, and it's just so funny. I think that's so crazy, but one thing I do want to add to this is uh, please, please grow this hair back. I think he definitely needs to grow the hair back. Um, I'm not a fan of the bald head. You know, uh, all I think about when I look at him is, uh, first of all, I think of Egghead Finn Balor, the action figure that's here on the channel. But then I think of Trash Corbin, and I don't like thinking of Trash Corbin when I think of Finn Balor. So I really want my boy here to grow his hair back. I think he's very handsome when he has his hair grown out. I think that's very important to his image and his character. So uh, hopefully he doesn't keep this for long. I'm not a fan. You know, uh, it's similar to like... Uh, it's, I wouldn't say it's similar to Shawn Michaels, but it's Shawn Michaels-esque as far as, like, you know, it's like, golly, it's hard to see this man bald, so uh, it's not like he had, you know, really long hair where, you know, it's a big deal, but uh, this is not like Triple H. I think, like, Triple H, I used to love Triple H with his long hair, and then when he cut it off, I was like, Jesus Christ, it really devastated me. But now, you know, we're used to it. He grew out the, the beard longer, and it kind of took over, and it makes him look better. And so, uh, I don't know. I'm just not feeling it here with Finn. I know his beard's not grown out fully here um, as far as, like, how thick and long he usually grows it out. So that may have something to do with it. Maybe if he had a longer beard, it would be different. But typically, when people shave their heads bald, that means they're going to grow out a nice long beard and a thick beard. And it looks a lot better. You know, you think of... Uh, uh, Triple H is the first one, obviously, that comes to mind, but there are many people that do the same thing, and um, again, it's not completely bald, so I don't know if he's going to grow out the beard. I don't know if he's going to grow his hair back just regular like it was. Hopefully, he does. I know that you know his hairline was kind of receding, but it's not that bad. It's not like Trash Corbin. I think that his worked completely, and uh, Trash Corbin's, I think it fit his character for him to be heel, unless the rumors are true, and Finn Balor's going to come back, join the OC with Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson. They're both bald, so maybe 
maybe that's part of their thinking. And then what if AJ Styles follows suit? He shaves his head. He ends up having that massive five head like we saw on that toy hunt that one time. And then you just have a big old faction of bald men or balding men all together in a faction dominating wrestling. I don't know. Just something that crossed my mind here. It's obviously jokes. That would be absolutely terrible if that happened. But, um, you know, uh, I, I don't like the, the bald head. You know, it is funny and it's a great, you know, it makes a great uh, little video and a great picture, you know, here on the screen. As you can see, comparing the meme Egghead Finn Balor to the actual Finn Balor. But I'm definitely not a fan of the haircut and I hope he does grow it out. And I don't know exactly what the story is. I know, again, he was traveling. I think he's on a vacation. You know, he lost to the, the Fiend Bray Wyatt at SummerSlam. And then he's uh, supposedly supposed to come back. He's supposed to take a break and that's what he's doing right now he's on a break and then he's going to come back and he's supposed to be turning heel I think again uh, I think the rumor sheet said that he's supposed to join the OC uh, join AJ Styles and the club and you know what I'd be cool with that I guess you know it'd give us a different look of Finn Balor but if he does that I don't want him to be bald and since his haircut's pretty short to begin with you know when he, his, his haircut's short anyway so it's not like it would take him that long to grow it back I don't think I think you could give him a month or two and his hair would probably for the most part be grown back I mean he keeps a short fade on the sides and back anyways and then the front is just kind of there and it's like three or four inches long so I mean I, I don't think it would take him that long to grow his hair back and again it's not completely bald so I don't think it would really take that much time uh, to get that hair back to the way it was but hopefully he does bring it back I really am not a fan of the baldness but uh, I wanted to get this video up to you guys and react to it because I know a lot of you guys were asking and I wanted to know your opinions on it and I wanted to know you know everything like that so all I have to do now is if he does return to television Vision. All I have to do is uh, maybe, I, I think I'd shave down the egghead part a little bit and then I would uh, come back. I may just make another one since, you know, I have so many Finn Balor head scans. I may just take an extra one, shave it down, you know, do another fix up on it. Uh, and, uh, you know, uh, probably add some hair lightness to the uh, to the head just to make it a little bit more accurate. Then add that to a top talent Finn Balor. Bamsies, Malamsies, you got yourself an updated Elite Finn Balor for 2019. And, uh, again, if you guys would like to make Egghead, Egghead Finn Balor or you would like to update your Finn Balor figure just for a funny picture or just because you want to do it, you can't go to that video. It's called How to Make, or Make, I think it's called Making WWE Action Figures Bald. It was supposed like a month ago again I think it was like July 29th or so and you can go back and you can watch that video and you know you can you can figure it out it's very simple you just take the Dremel shave the head down take some acetone wipe it off and you keep going until you're satisfied with the result be careful with that Dremel you will cut into the head so you got to get it real smooth and nice like uh, uh, Egghead Finn Balor and just like Finn Balor in real life now but uh, I just wanted to get this video up I did definitely want to react to it I thought it was absolutely hilarious I thought it was epic sauce and uh, I, I freaking love it, man. Freaking crazy. Egghead Finn Balor is an absolute real deal here in RL. So that is freaking crazy sauce. But uh, I think that is going to do it for today's video, guys. Just reacting to this. I have some epic WWE customs coming tomorrow, I think. I think we got some epic customs. We got some uh, we got some real deal stuff going on. I did finish Luchasaurus and I did finish Jungle Boy. So both of those will be up tomorrow. We also have some other customs that I'm working on. And uh, we have some other things in the works. MDT Live episode number 14 is also in the works. So that should be absolutely fantastic. Fantastic. Uh, you know, we got some big things going on in this episode. More Hell's Gate qualifiers. We have some more uh, things of that nature. And we're ahead of schedule. We're ahead of schedule big time, and I cannot wait. I'm literally thinking, um, I think I should be done filming maybe by uh, next Monday. Every match should be done, and maybe we'll have this episode up by next Wednesday or so. So MDT Live 14 will be up then, and then uh, we'll get working on f you know 15 for Vindication, the Go Home Show, and then 15 for MDT Live, and then it's Hell's Gate time. And uh, I'm also in the process of working on the stage for Hell's Gate, and we have some other things going on, and uh, it's it's freaking epic, man! Cannot wait for it. But a lot of questions going into MDT Live episode number 14. You know Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins. We got the MDT Championship picture. What's going on with the MDT World Tag Titles? Uh, Kevin Owens throwing away the MDT Extreme Championship last episode in the trash can. United States Champion Jack Swagger with his 100% Americans, uh, you know, running around with Zack Ryder and MVP. I mean, good stuff just all around, but that is going to do it, guys. Thank you so very much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy the video and my reaction to Egghead Meme Finn Balor. 
Subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE figure videos. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at MyDamnToys, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.